Das soll das nicht sein. It's Josh, Lydia and Tom. It's Jungle. Hello. How are you? Very well. Hello. Welcome to Canada. Thank you. What's going on? Um, we are here at Oceaga. 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 It's Oceaga. Oceaga. It's my third year. I think I've only just figured that out. Okay. It's Oceaga. Yeah. It's John O'Shaga. John O'Shaga. <laughs> <laughs> the Manchester United defender. I get that one. I did. <laughs> are you a United fan? Um, I, so I grew up in Manchester, but I'm... I'm from Scotland originally, so ah. I'm a Glasgow Rangers fan. Oh, the wrong oh, side of the town. Very niche. <laughs> I'll forgive you. Um, I'm so looking forward to your set later tonight. It's going to be so good. Uh, the tour just kicked off this weekend. The new world tour. Well, it's always it, a new world just, tour. Is it just an ongoing, never-ending? Kicked off four years ago. We technically had ten days off, so you can, <laughs> whether you want to amalgamate that into like, the, we've been, we've been technically been playing gigs on this run since okay, like August this last month's... year. We're all talking over each other. Fuck we it. should put our hand up. Yeah. <laughs> This me, month, me, please, next, pick me. This month's schedule has kicked off. This, this month's, weekend. yes. There yes. August 2024 is a big, has begun. This week's schedule. <laughs> is it? Do you say schedule? Schedule, schedule, schedule. I've lived here too long. <laughs> it's a schedule. Um, <laughs> massive congrats on selling out the O2. Thank you. Thank you. Are you looking forward to it? Yeah, very much so. Volcano is just, you know, it's still doing things to me. It's, it's just so good. What sort of things? <laughs> making me sing in the shower and I listen to it on my runs and I just yeah it's the best and now it's oh, turned you into Leonardo DiCaprio hey. congratulations thank you very much <laughs> uh, but no it's so good I mean do you have a favourite song to play live off it like, or does it change every week Liz any particular favourites I think my favourite to play is I've Been In Love right. yeah but it, yeah it does change every week yeah <laughs> Tom uh, Problems <laughs> nice yeah. Josh? Me? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't like any of them. <laughs> nah, not for me. What was it like that night when you uh, when you won that Brit Award? I mean, take me back. What, what do you remember? Well, it's, it's Tom's acting, which really just did it for me. He did this amazing... <laughs> the, the crocodile tears. Yeah, he went like this. No, those were legit tears. No, we've been practicing that for legit weeks. Tears. We went, uh, which was the stage school we went I just, to? I just, looked, I just looked at you and I was we like, We had a movement director. Man, we've been doing this since we were 10 years old. That's pretty fucking cool. That's what we learned in the acting school on Saturday. Stagecoach. Stagecoach. Oh, Sylvia Young. <laughs> Sylvia Young. <laughs> yeah. There you go. You go up. Oh my God. <laughs> You were just missing a cameo from Leo. Yeah, I know. Man. Where, where Wait, where you, yeah, I know. You ruined um, the script, but yeah. you didn't fucking turn up. Can we reenact all the, uh, <laughs> no, the shot, please? Too expensive. We're not, we're okay, not we'll do, do that. Um, and another headliner at this festival last night, Green Day, presented the award to you. Well, I mean, what a moment. Were you expecting that? Did you know they were going to be there? You should have heard what we whispered in their ears. <laughs> and you'll never know. <laughs> Wake me up. <laughs> when September ends. <laughs> Um, it was pretty cool meeting them. Yeah. They actually even asked me for a selfie backstage, which I thought was quite funny. No way. Did they? Yeah, yeah. They, they, were, they were walked past them in the backstage corridor and they were like, Tom, Tom, Tom. And you went, who, oh, me? <laughs> you were like, can you airdrop it to me? I was like, I used to watch MTV, you know, Gon Gonzo, them, all their videos on Gonzo and stuff like that. It was quite fun. The, uh, the album Volcano is just taken to the next level with the, the music videos and the, uh, the story that you tell with the choreography and stuff. I mean, it's just, it's exceptional. Would, would do you see yourself doing that on every project like going forward like you, you, yeah we got uh, yeah whoops let's <laughs> <laughs> get a little leak now. Um, okay. can we leak let's leak we've got some new some, some new, new ones coming out coming out very we soon we just shot some new videos that's a world first we're gonna get in trouble for this and I'm is it sure. a sequel to Volcano in terms of like the visuals or it's I think they're the best videos we've ever made it's definitely a continuation of the narrative okay very exciting. Okay, nice. Um, wow, I'm buzzing with that. Bye, You're Radio. the first person Exclusive. to know. Yeah, I didn't even know. <laughs> <laughs> you know, when you when you think about your your collaborations that you've had so far, I mean, um, do you have any more that you're just like on on the wish list? Like, do you ever do you ever just listen? listen to people's voices and you're like, yes, them like we need them. Yeah, quite a lot of people um, difficult to like put names out there because you never want to like, I guess, like either tempt fate or sort of like speak something into existence that won't but, uh, Yeah, but also manifest, you know? Yeah, maybe. But I think the manifestation <laughs> believe, happens internally. Believe, Thomas, believe. <laughs> yeah, actually, I was thinking about this the other day. Um, I think what would be quite cool is to get those instrumental features on the next album. So you get like Femi to come and play some drums. Santana. Santana, why not? Carlos see, Santana. Yeah, guitarist. Noel Gallagher. Little if guitar I Jack's interview, so... 
Okay. Hang on, we just have an idea. Keep going. <laughs> Keep going. <laughs> the concept um, is forming. The only thing I am annoyed about is that uh, Good Times wasn't on, on Volcano. Why didn't it make the cut? Oh, you um, have to ask um, Lydia about that. Lydia. Um, I think I was just a bit sick of it at that point, really. But, yeah, in hindsight, maybe it could have gone on. But well, it I felt like it was an older sound than Volcano. Yeah. Yeah. It felt a little bit too old, but problems sort of fit the vibe a bit more. Agreed. Okay. I think I think I think when we when we were like listening to the album like in sort of like in order and sort of trying to get the track listing right, um, yeah. it did just feel like the only song in the sort of like body of work that just didn't quite slot in properly. Okay, um, mm. I actually just recently had my engagement shower. Congratulations! And, uh, you were the playlist the whole the whole time. Fantastic! Aww. I actually just put on your uh, summertime sounds mix. Both of them. You've done two of them now, I think. The Sunshine Stereo. Sunshine, sunshine, yeah, sunshine, yeah, 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 that's yeah. it. Sunshine Stereo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So good. Like, everyone loved it. So. Oh, yeah. thank, thank you. you. Congratulations as well. Thank you very much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very um, nice. Yeah, and I'm sure you'll be uh, sound, the wedding? soundtrack to the wedding as well. It's in Scotland in July next year. See you there. Yes, please. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do it. Um, and finally, uh, memories about Glastonbury this year. What an epic performance on the, uh, was it the West Holt stage? Yeah, yeah. beautiful. Yeah. Um, just an amazing festival and like, I think just the general spirit of everyone that's there is yeah. so unified. Um, I think it's probably like unparalleled in terms of every other festival that we've ever been to. Yeah, and I think because you've obviously played Glastonbury before, but I think this time it just felt like, yes, like almost like the, the band is complete. Agreed. Yeah, <laughs> if you say so. Oh, actually, I'm going to ask you one more thing. Can you Deliberate amongst yourselves and come up with two truths and a lie about your pre-show ritual. And I've got to try and figure out the lie. Oh. Two truths and a lie. Yeah. Two lies and a truth. Two truths and a lie. Okay. Tell me and I'll pass it on. Keep it simple. We'll just make one up each. Here we go. And who's going to pick the real one? No, it's two truths. Yeah, two truths and a lie. Two lies and a truth. (laughs) I'll do a a truth. Yeah. I'll do it. You oh. Oh, no, you can't tell him what you're doing. See ya. <laughs> oh, <right>. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, I'll do the lie. Right. You two do the truth, yeah? Okay, I'll go first. I'll go first. Um, <clears throat> Lydia drinks a pint of red wine. Um, Josh likes to aggressively play Rage Against the Machine. <laughs> Thomas can be found driving golf balls out of the window. <laughs> uh, there's no wine in there, so... Is that the lie? The wine? No! Incorrect. <laughs> Incorrect. <laughs> is it the golf? The golfing? Yeah, yeah. The, golf's the, yeah. the, golf's the, the driving and the window. <laughs> yeah. Drink driving. All right, thank you so much. That thank was great. You. We're gonna thank you. Love it.